So, this is what I watched to try to calm my mind down. This is a video about the factory that the uh, OH-6 Cayuse was built in. Later it was called the OH-6 Little Bird, and then they had a version called the MD. Um, that's because it, it, at first it was a... Uh, it was built by a different aircraft company later on. Um, the MD-500, the MD-530, um, those are all variants of the OH-6 Loach. They're just modernized. More propellers, slightly different shape. It comes to a more of a cone. Anyway, that's not what this video is about. This video is actually about... I just got off the phone with James Payton, and... Jamie was pissed off because she was two-timing with Mark Harmon and James Payton. And although that's not everybody's business, it is everybody's business because it pertains to me and the fucked up situation that I was in. So, James and I spoke about the incident that happened there in uh, 2015 and the people that were there. And we spoke about the situation while I was there in September of 2016 and we also spoke about when I was there uh, in uh, 2017 just before Natalie was killed and we spoke about the last visit just a couple of weeks ago and Jamie was pissed off because after that video she realized that uh she had been busted, and James was going to know that she was two-timing uh, him, and Todd Harmon knew, was going to know that she was two-timing him, and that's the way it is. Um, the video is about an hour long, and we do discuss it. We also discuss the rape and how that's complete bullshit. And we discussed about, you know, his, a lot of stuff that really isn't everybody's business and doesn't need to be. Um, it's kind of like a lot of you ladies don't want somebody to talk about your women issues. That's understandable. Um, really, James realized that he was getting played. He was apparently dating Jamie while I was up there, and she hadn't told him that I was there, which I already knew. Um, but also there was Todd Harmon, who, was, who she was also dating while I was up there. And they tickled and kissed, and she talked to him every night. And, uh, yeah, it's a, a little bit different scenario. Um... That video that I made this morning about how a woman can beat on a man for half an hour and, and you know, it, he pushes her back and all of a sudden he's the fucking devil for trying to get her to get the fuck away from him. Yeah. So he said he didn't know about Seth being an asshole or harassing me or any of that. So he's going to talk to Seth about it and ask Seth to knock it off. And I respect that. Um, now that I know that Jamie was pulling the same shit with James and Todd Harmon that he was pulling with Otska and Hayden McCall and Todd Rust and like three other dudes here in Chapel, the fact that she's doing that up there today to this day doesn't surprise me. But it makes perfect sense why she's pissed the fuck off. Of course, I'm good at breaking stuff up like that. When uh, when she was pulling that shit with Hayden, I was the reason that Hayden fucking got away from her and started dating somebody else. Um, he didn't realize Jamie was doing that to other people as well. And once he realized it, he was fed up with it. Um, so... I guess that's the video for right now. 
Um, I had a video that I recorded earlier that's about half an hour long, um, and I'll probably try to post it tonight as well. I just, I had a lot of stuff to do. I'm babysitting some dogs, and I'm trying to get it all set up with my paperwork that's over at somebody else's house so that I can use that paperwork. I won't be able to really sit down with it until next week when I'm dog sitting again. But uh, that's the way life goes, right? So, little bit by little bit, the things that I've told you are starting to come to light that I've been telling the truth. And the parts where people lied to me and I repeated that lie, well, it's nice to know that it's a lie. Now, as far as who's telling the truth between James and Jamie, I... Fuck, I don't even care anymore at this point. I'm just fucking wanting James to be able to clear his name and also confront Jamie with some evidence. So I need to get that computer back from uh, Wyoming. It's got that recording with Jamie on it. And this computer has the one with the boy on it. So I'm going to send it to him. Um, 